Hey guys, these are my top picks for best skins as of the moment for Snowbreak. So, without further ado, let's check them out. Okay guys, so in no particular order, we have our top 10. So, there's no ranking in this video. All of them are great. First off, we'll be starting with uh, separate skins, not the OG skins. We're going to be talking about the OG skins later. But first is going to be Yao. And she belongs to the first batch of swimsuits that we had for last year. Although last year's swimsuits were a bit delayed. But these were one of the best skins for one of the best DPS during that time. So again, this year, devs should go crazy with swimsuit designs i'm actually happy that they were uncensored they were not censored for you know for for the best part of what has happened in the past few days but this swimsuit is actually very very nice and I expect more from the devs moving forward next up is going to be enya so this is her nurse outfit enya the nurse and uh, I already have her, you know, have her skin for her pistol. Definitely, it's going to be a nice add-on to the skin because it's a theme of an injection, perhaps. This, and with her interactable, you know, scene, is actually a nice combination. So this one, also one of the best add-on skins that they have so far. And one of my top 10. Okay, for Tess' secret date outfit, this actually is better than her magician, the, the bunny outfit for magician. This takes the cake, and we see a lot of things going on in this outfit. This, I think, was part of the battle pass, if you can remember. And um, again, these skins can be availed up to August 30, so if you want these skins be my guest get them because they'll be gone while they're you know while they're in the store better get them right now so this one is actually a nice cool girl outfit that she has kind of a school girl um but again this you know takes the cake for the third outfit in this top 10. next up is going to be chen shing so chen shing a recent addition this skin should have been out when she came out this is a little bit delayed but who can you know who can complain this has interchangeable parts as you you know as we come here let us um let us see how we're going to be retrofitting her you can retrofit her with um different types or you can take off her stockings and uh, I prefer it, it on, actually. But again, if you get my drift, this has a lot of add-ons depending on, you know, what you prefer. But definitely, this Dragoness skin is actually my liking. Okay, for Katya, this is her graceful da dance, dance -us. It's difficult to pronounce, but definitely of all her skins aside from the secretary skin this one is one of my favorites this has a little bit of a peak and uh, again she 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 really struts this this costume very very good especially with the pose i like this it goes really with her hair as well and it's so elegant so again um gonna miss the og katya we'll go to her later so we better go to the next skin then there you go <laughs> okay our next skin is going to be a covert um skin from haru covert zephyr so this one is her tactical suit this one is a different version of her original tactical suit for her og version but this one should have been her OG version, I tell you guys. This one with, you know, with a very proportionate, you know, proportion, proportionate in terms of uh, her top, her bottom, and everything else. So this actually is part of my top 10. This is one of my favorites when I play her. So definitely Haru was one of my favorites when she came out. And apart from Katya, both of them actually 
changed the game for us players during that time, who started during that time, or even before they came out. Okay, next up is going to be Fanny Coronet with matching skin from her shotgun. This is so far the best skin that I made for her, hands down. Um, really, really big fan of this skin. Um, it has a lot going in there, and it really matches her, you know, her demeanor. So, again... These skins are... She, she does have a lot of skins, but this one takes the cake. Okay, next up is going to be Life Wild Hunt. While well, Life Wild Hunt has a number of, uh, you know, skins here, this one definitely is one of my favorites for her. Aside from this one, the Nightfall Scarlet, this one is a, is a little bit conservative, but... This one was one of the best designs before, but I will take this design over that one because when you turn around the back, as you can see there, um, her, you know, her buttocks are actually squeezing out a bit. So again, a nice skin, very simple. Uh, she looks like she's in a urban combat situation, but Again, this skin is definitely very playful and uh, very her, I think, with the matching top or tube and with the jacket. I, you know, you can't go wrong with this, especially when she turns around. Next up is a recent acquisition of ours, which is Infinite Sight Life with her wedding skin. This one really, really is nice, especially with the blue and the white, you know, the, the, the blue accents with the white. This one made my day, really, when I saw this. This was one of the, is one of the best wedding skins. Hopefully next year, they could outdo themselves with another wedding batch or, you know, other, other operatives that can marry the adjutant. But for now, this skin, this, this, this wedding skin is, takes the cake. It has all of the aspects of, you know, it has covers, it has peaks, it has a lot of things going. I don't want to elaborate more, so let's go more. Go to the next one. <laughs> okay, last on our list is going to be Akasha Kaguya, Allure of Lotus. Although this unit came out together with the rest, you know, um, they are the first ones that came out. This skin was one of the top that they've made, really. It's, let's have a close look here. So again, again, this one has a lot of peaks at the side. Um, again, very, very nice skin. To have even her hair I really like her hair here so again that rounds up my top 10 let's move on to the OG skins we have only five that I've selected but again the OG skins are the base skins that we have so let's start with number one she's number one but again this doesn't have a ranking we have a top five for the OG skins so far right now for agave she takes a lot of the kick in terms of um, her OG skin, a lot of things showing there in the midriff area and a lot of things showing on top. So I can't complain. Probably the best tactical skin so far, <laughs> I think. But we'll move on to number two and see what you think. Okay, so for number two on this list, we have Chen Xing, Ethereal Cloud, this original skin was actually very, very nice. It was well designed together with uh, Wild Hunt's, um, what do you call this? Wild Hunt's uh, skin. This one is, it's designed very well. I, I don't know why they weren't, you know, they, they started this design, probably one of the first skins that, we, you know, uh, one of the first uh, updates from the original update. And I'm not sure why they went a different way with this type of a design. Um, this is kind of classy. 
but again sexy at the same time so this one Chen Xing takes it at number two again not a ranking but two on the list for OG skins okay for our OG skin that is soon gonna be you know gonna be tinkered with this skin of Katcha is by far for me the best OG skin base skin that we have in the game hands down hands down um i don't know if you agree with me or not but this is the best um this really 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 made me enthusiastic again about the game and up until now whether they're gonna be covering the mid portion or the back portion it doesn't matter she has still one of the best skins in a game i'm sorry but what do you think guys do you agree with me when i say that she is the best og skin in the game put it down in the comment section speaking of og skins she is one of the most og skins that we have she this is the base model for fanny coronet and um it's still nice to see her in this skin um way back then this was the best really in terms of looks in terms of um, functionality and looks this was the best and this was i think um kind of the most peak that you had before in terms of in terms of the skins for the og um og ops that came in so again one of the best OG, you know, skins released uh, in version 1.0 and still now is one of the best skins that I've ever seen. Okay, so last on my list is actually Haru for the top five OG skins. Um, this one, I think, was the first tactical skin that, that they released, really. Um it has a lot of going on there this skin has a lot of detail including the small you know the short sword that she has on her back she also has a hood there for tactical incursions again this skin is skin has a lot of details and so far one of the best og skins that we have um haru is is you know is is well known for an operative so both og skins are going to be very good for me so what do you think guys uh, again this is not a ranking of, of the skins these are the top five add on uh, top five og skins and top 10 add-on skins that we have in the game so before they leave us i'd like to showcase them and i'd like to give you guys my thoughts on how the skins look and thank you guys for staying this far take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here